Have you ever wondered if time flows differently in space? Well, according to Einstein's theory of relativity, it does. In 2015, NASA astronaut Scott Kelly spent nearly a year aboard the International Space Station, traveling at over 28,000 kilometers per hour, 400 kilometers above Earth. Meanwhile, his identical twin brother Mark stayed on Earth. The result? When Scott returned, he was a few milliseconds younger than Mark. This isn't science fiction, it's time dilation. Einstein predicted that the faster you move, and the further you are from a massive object like Earth, the slower time passes for you compared to someone standing still. It means that astronauts in orbit actually age a tiny bit slower than we do down here. But that's just part of the story. NASA scientists studied the Kelly twins before, during, and after the mission. They discovered that space travel doesn't just alter time, it alters the body too. Scott's genes, immune system, and even memory were affected. While most changes reversed after returning to Earth, some didn't. Here's a brain teaser. If you lived on top of a mountain, time would pass slightly faster for you than for someone at sea level. If one twin traveled at near light speed and returned to Earth, they'd be years younger than the one who stayed behind. Even the cells in our bodies feel the effects of space. Telomeres, the tiny end caps of our DNA that shorten as we age, actually grew longer in space. But they returned to normal after Scott came home. Yet space isn't kind to the body. Muscles weaken, bones lose mass, and the immune system goes into overdrive, all due to the lack of gravity. So does space make you younger? Technically, yes, by a few milliseconds. But the physical stress might aid you in other ways. In the end, Einstein was right. Time is relative. And in space, it's even stranger than we imagined.